have your thoughts on whether uh, the Senate is justified in uh, rejecting the motion for subpoena for a Supreme Court justice Meron and talaga. other court employees. Yung other court employees, eh, ko kung parang sana, sana pwede patawag yun. No? Yung Supreme Court justices, I think, will be treated as a co-equal. And that has been the tradition and the practice. Yung, yung, yung asupina kasi says you have power over somebody. And yung kung co-equal kayo, medyo mahirap nga naman yata yung isasamon mo yung co-equal mo. Pwede mo imbitahin. Uh, kung ma-achieve naman natin sa others who are not on a co-equal basis like the employees, yung gusto natin maipanabas dyan, sana pa, pa yung tulutan yun. But they, they are, no, they are the ones tasked to come up with the resolution of the issue and uh, they will be guided by their best lights, meaning the Senate. Sir, are you hopeful that uh, Justice Serena would uh, defy yung Supreme Court rules on yung Kung appearance pwede, niya? Hindi na muna ako mag-comment dyan. Pag, nag pag dumating siya, sasabihin, natusan ko siya. Kung hindi naman siya mag-attend, parang walang sagot na tama dyan sa tanong na yun. Eh. Norman, I hope you understand. Sir, last na lang. Uh, is this one of the yung mga usaping legal na tinutukoy niyo po dati na naglalayo sa taong bayan dun sa impeachment process? Yung palagi ko naman, as, as I keep saying, no, marami na naipakita. No? Marami na napatunayan kung doon tayo papasok sa betrayal of the Constitution or even na yung, yung uh, sorry, culpable violation of the Constitution or in betrayal of the public trust. No? Or even yung issues about wealth, yung sasal. So any of the artic eight articles any and all, no? Yung any of them can is just is enough to be able to achieve the necessary objective. Thank you, sir. Holding the lantern, una just din yo DGWB. Good morning, sir. Sir, are you supportive of a move by some lawmakers banning Mr. Steve Wynn from investing in the country, uh, even if this might discourage other investors from putting up their businesses here in the Philippines? Well, you see, Mr. Wynn is just one investor. There are so many other investors. There is, in fact, um, I, I can't go into details, no? Dahil merong may, may injunction on DTI and a strict confidentiality. But I was just given a three-page uh, list no, of investors who have actually come in who are uh, already scouting. In other words, there are others who are scouting properties that they need, no? Dahil yung quantity of land that they need is medyo substantial. Yung isa na magte-testing lang, 10 hectares ang hinahanap for a factory. So, yung if an investor comes in, no, they have to also comply with yung our requirements. Now, to speak specifically of Mr. Wynn would mean that there's a conclusion already to the ongoing investigation headed by the Executive Secretary to this whole issue. And I'm not yet, uh, I'm not comfortable having a categorical statement prior to the termination of the investigation. Just a follow-up, sir. Uh, may deadline po ba kayong sinet for ES Ochoa para tapusin yung investigation uh, versus uh, Chema Nagyo? Yung after roughly about a year and uh, ilan naman kami ngayon, four months ago, months. eight months, no? sanay na kami sa isa't isa na alam na niya pag may binigay ako assignment, no? yung, minam yung mamadali niya dahil ayaw niyang pag-finalo up ko, eh wala sa masabi. Okay. So sanay na, alam na, na pag meron akong pinag-interest talaga, I have a reasonable time, but I have to follow up with it. Okay, thank you, sir. Holding the question, Willard, EBS-CBN. Willard. Good morning, sir. Sir, were you invited by the Iglesia Ni Cristo to its gathering today? And if so, would you be attending? And if ever, what you, would you be your message to them? Well, ang, ang pagkasabi sa akin, lahat imbitado dito. Dahil, di ba, parang ito nga yung part of the evangelization work. Evangelization work. But at the same time, uh, para may pinarating naman na pag my presence might make a, give a political tinge to the whole affair which detracts from the religious uh, intention of this activity. So, yung message to them, I think it's, uh, I don't think I have a very specific message to them. Of course, uh, I was supported by the church in 2010 and also in 07. So, nandun yung thank you. Um, I'm sure that they have been partners uh, like when I was still a congressman in, in Tarlac, no? Yung mga cleanliness drives were yung a lot of the yung the warm bodies on the street actually performing it were members of the their church. Mm -hmm. So from there also thank you Ren. No. So yung like any other Filipino, we are really endeavoring to provide each and everyone all the opportunity towards personal advancement, regardless of uh, of faith, regardless of uh, political beliefs, 
Now, these opportunities, I think, are the primary duty. I mean, provision of these opportunities is the primary objection and duty of the government. Sir, follow up now. Do you share the sense that uh, the Iglesia may be giving you a subtle message by gathering this much people, considering that a number of them are known to be supportive of the Chief Justice? How about the number who are supportive of our efforts? I think you should also mention that. Pero huwag natin kalimutan, no? uh, pinalalo rin sa atin, uh, 2014 marks their centennial. And they would, of course, that would be a very major event no, in their calendar. And these are activities geared towards maximizing the 2014 centennial celebration. Na. These are the building actions towards that very grand event that they want. So yung, there are others who are saying that there is a political dimension here. Their official uh, communication to us is this is part of the religious obligations and part of their faith. And um, like any other uh, adherence of a particular faith, you would want to to, exp um, para to gain more and more adherence. Then this is your, your view of the truth, and you would want to share that also. So they want um, a very significant centennial celebration in two years' time, and they have deemed it this is necessary to lead to that. Thank you, sir. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. President. Thank, Thank you. you.